at the end of days. The first sign shall appear in the heavens. Justice shall fall upon the world of men. The armies of light and shadow will clash across the fields of eternity. Should be getting you home. But there's still work to be done. If these translations are correct, <coughs> the powers of hell could already be on the move. The world must be told of the coming darkness. You do believe me, don't you, Leah? It has begun. Leave it, Uncle. It's not important. I have honored my pledge to Leah and rescued Cain. All that stands between me and the mystery of the fallen star is the Skeleton King, whose return has again darkened Tristram. I have journeyed far to find that the fallen star was only a man. Who is he? And why has he come? He remembers nothing. Perhaps Cain can tell us what the stranger cannot. Forbids us from interfering with the mortal world. Yet you have done so. 
brazenly. All I am guilty of, Imperius, is bringing justice while you hide, cowering behind your throne. Silence! You will now answer for your transgressions. Judge me. I am justice itself. We were meant for more than this. To protect the innocent. But if our precious laws bind you all to inaction, then I will no longer stand as your brother. Tristram is safe. I travel to Chaldeum, the great city of the East. It has fallen before one of the last lords of hell, Belial. I mean to set the city free. Magda swore that the demon lord Belial would soon rule our world. I am all that stands between him and the end of mankind. We rescued Leah's mother, the witch Adria. She told us of the Black Soul Stone, an artifact that could destroy evil forever. Of all mortals, I have been given the task of retrieving it. Am I 
I supposed to see? Chaldeum is free from Belial and his deception. Only Asmodan remains. He sends his army forth to strike at us from the heart of Ariad Crater. Bastion's Keep is all that stands between us and certain doom. I will not allow it to fall. Bastion's Keep has been saved. Enough fighting within walls. I will now take the fight to Asmodan's war machines upon the open fields. shattered and the way to Asmodan is now open. He has brought hell itself into the crater, powering his legions with vile sin hearts. I will destroy them and bring the Lord of Sin to justice.
betrayal is complete, and Leah's soul is lost. Through her, Diablo has been reborn as the prime evil, with all the powers of hell at his command. The high heavens tremble. The angels are helpless before Diablo's assault. Only I remain to set things right and vanquish Diablo's evil forever. Diablo sought to crush heaven with despair, but I have defeated his champion and restored hope. I believed Tyrael's faith would be restored as well, but he remains lost. Regardless, I will now shatter Diablo's infernal portals. Diablo seeks to corrupt the Crystal Arch atop the Silver Spire. If he succeeds, heaven will fall. Everything has led to this moment. Tyrion and I will fight our way to the top, where I will finally confront Diablo. In the end, it was a mortal heart that saved two worlds from ruin and cast down the prime evil forever. champion, the Nephilim, rose to confront the darkness that we, in our pride, would not face. place among you once again but this time as a mortal since justice has been met this day I will now stand as wisdom on behalf of those who risked all to save us Forevermore, we shall stand together, angels and men, in the light of this glorious new dawn. essence lingers in the black soul stone. I cannot destroy the stone, nor allow its evil to remain within the heavens. And so it must be hidden, even from the angels. I pray that it will be enough.
done well, Horadrim. Your service here is finished. And you should all... run. Refugees on the road tell me that angels prey on Westmarch, laying waste and murdering thousands, and no one knows why. I have no love for this city, but I will not stand by while its people are slaughtered. These Reapers will learn that they are not the only killers in Westmarch. vanquished Urzael and his Reapers, giving the people of Westmarch their city back. Lorath and I go to the Blood Marsh to find Adria. She knows how to locate Malthale. She will tell me, and then she will pay in blood for her betrayal. Malthale tried to stop me from entering Pandemonium, but nothing will keep me from him. Now I will cross these battlefields, where angels and demons once fought. I must find the Pandemonium Fortress, where the Angel of Death waits for me. I will show him what death means.
The Nephilim have done the impossible. By conquering death, he had redeemed the angels and saved all mankind. In that moment, with victory at hand, I saw the Nephilim in a new light. He is a hero who can defeat the champions of heaven and hell, and a barbarian who protects the innocent. But within him beats a mortal heart that will one day be tempted to corruption. On that day, will he have the strength to resist, or will he be 